Our midday newscast, police held a news conference just about 30 minutes ago and said this suspect is connected to the deaths of four family members in a home over the weekend. Today's scene on Alder Drive near Gulfton in southwest Houston. Our Taisha Walker is there. She is joining us live with the latest. Taisha, good afternoon. Andy, good afternoon. In that press conference that you mentioned that took place 30 minutes ago, we also learned that the man that shot and killed himself here at the scene inside of a vehicle right behind me um, was the suspect behind a quadruple homicide last week. You'll recall that on September 5th, police found two adults and two children shot in a home in the 7500 block of Emogene Street. The crime was covered up by a fire. Police today tell us witnesses had identified a suspect from that scene. They also say that a car was missing from the home. Officers located both today, and while walking up to the suspect in the vehicle, they say he shot himself once. That man was taken to a hospital where he died. Uh, they also tell us that they located a weapon here today, which may be similar to the one used to kill the family of four. In addition to that, uh, a weapon was also recovered at this scene here today, and that weapon is also similar to the weapon that was used at the original scene. However, we will do more scientific testing to confirm to confirm our findings. So there's two things that we still don't know at this hour is the motive and two, the identity of the suspect. The Houston police do tell us that he was related to that family of four that died on Imogene Street. They tell us that he was the stepson of the man that died and the son of the woman. Reporting live in Southwest Houston, Taisha Walker, KPRC 2 News.